everybody. I'm Starla. I'm Mick. And we are Our Fan Plays Games. Games. Yeah. <laughs> and welcome to our preview of Maple Valley. Yeah. Designed by Roberta Taylor and sponsored by Kids Table Board Gaming. Hey, family. This is a good one, but I just want to let you know that it's on Kickstarter right now. So go out and check it out. But like we say for all of our previews, don't take a word for it. Go check it out. See if you like it for your family, gaming group, or whatever. Maybe for yourself. But also, this is a prototype, so things will change and get better. But first, let's hear from Starla about the overview and gameplay. Here we go. It's the first day of spring, and the critters of Maple Valley are preparing for the annual spring festival. While the adults prepare the village, the local children are tasked with searching the woodlands for the ingredients needed to make a dazzling variety of party favors, and make sure that the festivities are ready to go by the time dusk arrives. The game is divided into five rounds called Hours and you want to be the critter that brings the most joy to the festival. You'll achieve your score mainly by completing favors, assembling a large group of friends, by collecting skill-boosting patches, and from your stash of leftover resources when the party starts. There are a lot of ways to make the festival special. When the fifth hour has ended, dusk has arrived and the game is over, so proceed to final scoring. Once all final scoring is complete, the player with the highest score, the one who brought the most joy to this year's festival, is considered the winner. Maple Valley. Now, this is in the Creature Comforts universe. Yes. And Creature Comforts, the game, yeah. was really cool. You yes. know, we really like that. We really like yes. that game. It, now, it's got this really cute little they got yes. creatures that yes. are so cute, but don't let the cuteness fool you. No. Creature Comforts yes. is a tough one. Yes, it is a tough one. But now, they kept a lot of the elements mm -hmm. from the Creature Comforts game mm -hmm. in Maple Valley. Yes. Which is really, really interesting and cool. Mm -hmm. You know, we still have, you know, some of the, you know, the cards where you have mm -hmm. to steal, you know, get a lot of resources to build your, yep. now they call favors. Yes. Over here. And, mm -hmm. you know, you also have the festivities because, you know, like in Creature Comforts, they had these friends that came to town. That's right. And you get bonuses and things like that from mm -hmm. the friends. Now they have festivities mm -hmm. here where you when you complete, you know, the favors, mm -hmm. you put your little cube on some of the different favors because they're, you know, they're either music because mm -hmm. you're helping out with the, the festival. Yes. You know, you got five hours, which is five rounds, to get the festival together. So your favors kind of help out, you know, they have a fruit punch mm -hmm. bowl and some other little things. Yeah. And once you complete them, you put your little cube over here that you kind of like completing like different festival, you know, items. Mm -hmm. You know, like here you have like a gift swap or a great feast or the parade. And, yeah. you, and then when you complete one of these festivities, you you know, there's a bonus. There is. You know, and and what really I cool. thought was really nice is that they kept the same creatures from Creature Comfort. Yes, they did. So that way I got a chance to play with my raccoons again. Yeah. And you got your bunny. Bunny Mafia. Yes. Yes. And it's interesting how the little uh, creatures, they go around the board. Yes. And they collect little curiosities like little bugs or rocks or flowers. And then they also get a chance to collect goods. And those goods help you fulfill the requirements of some of the cards. Cards, whether it be a mm -hmm. favorite card mm -hmm. or whether it be uh, getting another friend to help you uh, get ready for this fest festivities. But you know, the movement is really interesting because mm -hmm. you gotta keep, for, in your mm -hmm. turn, you gotta get more of your critter friends. Mm -hmm. So, cause your critter friends will give you chances to go through these different routes, mm -hmm. which is forest and you know, I guess this is like ca canyon, you're going through the mm -hmm. canyon and then water. Mm -hmm. But the way to go through, you gotta get the different friends yes. to keep you moving. Yes, because like your main friend gives you three different routes. Yes. But then the other friends have specific routes. Like yes. some can can only go through the forest or some can only go through water mm -hmm. so you got to make sure you fill your hand with a variety of friends so you can go do, through the different routes and not be stuck somewhere because you don't have that type of friend to get you where you need to go and then those friends give you bonuses they give you bonuses. some of them give you bonuses mm -hmm. but the 
the real thing is, is that in order to get around, mm -hmm. you need to have those a lot of friends mm -hmm. or just have friends and then these maps. You got to get some yes. maps to get you around. That'll help you maps get where you need to go. Maps are valuable. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if you want to visit some of the outposts, yes. and sometimes you may want to collect a patch because a patch can help you with different mm -hmm. things. So these little friends, they're going around the board and they are some hard workers. They hard they workers. They are hard workers. They be moving. Yes, they trying to moving. collect different things so they can get ready for this festival. And it's, you know, it's a really, mm -hmm. you know, it keeps you moving, mm -hmm. you know, and I guess when the turns get more deeper, you know, like, mm -hmm. you know, the first and second turn, I mean, first and second round, you're not going to have that many critter no, friends to help you out. you're building up. You're getting your hand built But by up. that last, mm -hmm. by the fifth mm -hmm. round, you got to, you, hopefully you have a lot of critter friends mm -hmm. that keep, keep you going around this board and doing some things. Yeah, so, because, yeah. you know, it's, it's got worker placement elements. Yes. It's got de uh, hand management elements. Yes. It's kind of like a deck builder, too. Yeah, kind of Because you got to build yeah. your deck so you have enough things, enough, for that things, critter friends, friends yes. to get you around the board. So you got a lot of different things you have to work with to get make to be successful at this game. And then you also, it's that catch-up mechanic. Yes. Yes. Called the dwaddle. Dwaddle. And in when you get, in, like, if I have, like, three critter friends mm -hmm. and Starla only has two, she gets a dwaddle card, which is pure... You know, resources yes. or goods that they say, goods. Mm -hmm. So that really helps out too. Yeah, and that makes sure everybody has equal turns. Yes. That way in the next round, if he has four cards and I only had uh, four friends and I only had three friends, that Dwaddle card would give me a fourth uh, chance to play so everybody's equal. But that that but that but card gives you just pure re, uh, yes. goods. Yes, we need those And that those helps goods. you hit those goods. You, know, <laughs> you need them to, to complete your favors mm -hmm. and stuff. So yeah, this is a very interesting game. Yeah. And, and it's very family friendly. It's family not hard. Friendly. It's not hard to learn no. at all. Oh. Well, you know, when we were learning this game, yes. we got a chance to do that with Reggie, who's an OFPG voice. Yes, he, he was in town, mm -hmm. and we were able to bring it and kind of learn some more about mm -hmm. it and get a chance to play like a three-player game with Reggie, which was really, really cool. While we were at and we were so down. glad he was mm -hmm. here. And he, you know, he played with us, and we learned it and mm -hmm. tried to get some stuff. So it was, it was a lot of fun. I mean, it's, yes. it's something that's going to be attractive to look at on your table. Yes. I mean, look at the color. I mean, come on, it's yeah. color everywhere. It's color everywhere. And that's always color interesting because it draws in the yes. eye. Yes. So this is something you want to look at for your family or your yes. friends. If they like things like this, check out the Kickstarter page. Definitely check out mm -hmm. the Kickstarter. Definitely. Yeah. And it's going to get even better. So this is just a prototype, mm -hmm. but it's going to get better. Yeah. But like we say, for all of our previews, check it out yourself. Don't yes. take our word for yes. it now. So but that's it. That's it. This is Maple Valley, yes. which is part of the Creature Comforts universe. Yes. So check it out because I like being in the Creature Comforts universe. It's fun. <laughs> it's fun being with the you know little wood creatures yeah, and all that stuff. Yeah, creatures. Yes. And see, in this one, you don't have to worry about the winter. You know, in Creature Comforts, yeah. the winter is coming. Yeah. In this one, you just get ready to party. You get <laughs> You're ready to party, family. Yeah, you're collecting all kinds of Yeah, you're getting ready to party. You know, get a t tambourine and all <laughs> you ready to go have some fun. Oh, fun. Yes, I like that. <laughs> so, Starla, where can they find RPG so they can hang out in Creature Comfort Land with <laughs> us too? You know? Well, if you're looking for Our Family Place Games, yes. you can find us on Facebook, mm -hmm. Instagram, yep. Twitter, yep. and right here on YouTube. Right here. Now, Starla, Thank you so much for being here, being in the in the creature come <laughs> universe. Cause universe we gonna go party we, together. That's right. We can get but, your get your party little, stuff. Little raccoons, they ready to go. Starla, get your party <laughs> stuff, cause we going to party. Yeah. And we wanna thank KTBG for sponsoring this preview. And hey, just want you to know, thank you for coming to our family to check it out and see what's going on. But again, check out the Kickstarter; it's going on right now. That's right. But you know, please, we wanna hear your comments, yeah. your questions, and all that. But family, there's one thing. And one thing we want you to always know, we love you. Bye, Bye now. Everybody.